buying a car with a loan? Show this to your finance officer. Hello, my friend, Kevin Hunter, the Homer guy here. Congratulations, you have another customer in finance in the box, but today there's a twist. This isn't your typical car buyer, and they're hoping that you're not the typical finance officer either. Here's your chance to be a hero instead of what your customer was expecting. Let me explain. You and I both know that your office is under huge pressure all the way up to the ownership to hammer stuff like warranties, gap insurance, a variety of other insurance policies, and fees, tons of fees. I don't think I need to say anything more. Many finance officers I talk to, if they had it entirely their way, would have had a much more friendlier process for the customer. This visit would be like talking to an actual banker. Well, today's your chance to do exactly that with this customer. Instead of canned product pitches, have a conversation like a friend and a trusted advisor. Just wing it with what you already know instead of all those word tracks. Just be you. After all, you have tons of resources at hand and we both know it. Why not use your resources this time for the honest benefit of your customer? I'm talking about real benefits, not benefits that require rationalizations and these made-up stories and diversions. We're talking about 20 to 30 minutes and they're out the door. Not that two-hour marathon that can easily happen at other dealerships. I know you're tracking with me because literally every former finance manager who reaches out to our channel says they'd much rather have it this way. So here's your shot. I do have a couple of suggestions about the actual loan. The interest rate this customer deserves, it's right on the approval directly from the bank. Show that to the customer without first changing the screen to the customer view, that sneaky little move. Don't do that. Show them what the real buy rate is. Before you ask them to sign the contract, show them the buyer's order too. Something most car buyers never get a chance to see. It's a clean snapshot of their deal, much cleaner than the car contract. Give them a chance to look at it without undue pressure or telling them what they should be looking at. You see, the elephant in the room is that no finance officer should be trusted. Does it have to be that way? No. You can be the exception. Think back to a time when dealers first started offering in-house financial services. There wasn't a stack of fees. There wasn't a boatload of products they shoved down people's throats. Nobody ever used the phrase, protecting your investment. No, instead it was just a plain, simple process. No stress, no BS, just the price of the car you agreed to pay with the state taxes, title, and licensing fees. A lot of the small dealers still have this. It was an out-the-door price. When finance offered a loan term and interest rate, it wasn't fattened up. Everything was reasonable, fair, and honest. A straight-up clean deal. Pretty much everyone drove away with a car loan that they could actually afford. And things like needing gap insurance and having problems with negative equity later, well, those weren't even conversations. That's exactly what your customer is looking for today. After this is all done, I'm asking your customer to do you a great favor. Review your dealership and you on Yelp, on Google, on Facebook, and even in the comment section right here on this video. Anywhere it helps you the most to drive customers to you. Good dealers and good people like you are exactly what is needed to fix the bad reputation the car business has. Now go ahead and make us proud to know you. I'm Kevin Hunter, the Homework Guy, looking forward to being a part of your success story.